Hello, this is the Saturday Wrap for Saturday the 4th of June 2022. Actually, it's not. I'm doing this on Friday the 3rd, um, mainly because there's a Beano tomorrow and I prefer to do it this way and I can get a semi-lower third, so why not? Okay, so it's Friday, um, 9.17 British summer time. It is summer outside. It's the second day of the 17th Jubilee bank holiday uh, with Sunday services on the buses. I'll come back to that. Anyway, we're drinking Belgian. We're drinking quality. This is an A-. minus For all those people who say I don't go above B++, that's an A minus. It's a double. It's a Trappist Ale. It's superb. And you can get it in Tesco's, which I like a lot. So, anyway, um, oops. Yeah, my notes are over there. Um, in Upnote, which I'm still using and still liking. So, here's the thing. Um, word or phrase of the week? No confidence. Okay, applying to the Tories at the moment, but to be perfectly honest, I don't have confidence in any political party. I think they're all, they all say one thing and do another thing, um, and blame, and don't come forward with their own positive policies. And nothing's for free. We'll give you free this. Uh, no, you won't. You're going to have to get the money from somewhere. <sighs> And you usually end up paying for it. Oh yeah, um, public transport. I have no confidence in public transport. Look at the airlines. Look at the overselling. Look at the airports. Um, should have come as no surprise that all these people were turning up at airports because the flights were already booked there. The fact that they had to cancel the flights suggests, it doesn't even suggest, it's a fact. Those flights were already scheduled in. Yeah, take the money and worry about it later. It's a bank holiday. It's two bank holidays and a trot. Uh, I was expecting to go to Newport on the bus, um, which are subsidised here in Wales by the Welsh Assembly local government down the docks people. They're running a Sunday service. And you may say to yourself, well, don't the bus drivers deserve a day off as well? Or even two. Um, yes, they do. But don't expect people to rely on public transport when public transport can't be relied upon. People will get cars. And that's why they have cars, because they are far more reliable than public transport. And then there's trains. Well, Transport for Wales Rail still having issues not enough trains uh, other issues as well and now there's a strike looking to be coming along there's been a vote on it so i won't be booking any long distance train journeys in the near future because you can't rely on them public transport doesn't do what it says on the tin okay that's a little bit of a rant i like a good rant Anyway, app of the week. Um, okay, so you remember I had a bit of a problem with my umbrella. Couldn't get past the web interface. Had to SSH into it. And I could shut it down that way. Um, it just seemed like the web browser wasn't working properly or the web engine. Um, so I was looking for something for my iPhone and iPads. Web SSH. Really, really good. Does practically everything I need. There's a couple of bells and whistles which are in-app purchase. The in-app purchase is 10 quid a month. Okay, so this is a pro app used by pros and firms will be paying that. But wow, 10 quid a month. I just wouldn't use it. Um, I wouldn't pay 10 quid a month for practically anything, to be perfectly honest. But, you know you got to be careful. Um, and the last thing of the uh, the thing of the week, Platinum Jubilee, Platts Jubes or whatever they're calling it. Um, we're doing nothing in our street. We 
which is just the way I like it. Um, it's mainly been me out in the back garden, Tesco's um, finest smoked bacon over the Trangia, bioethanol, the odd burger or two, planting, radishes, spring onions, salad leaves. I've had a go at just planting them on top of the compost this time and watering them well in. I hope that's going to work. Uh, anyway, um, really by now I should have my tomatoes out and my peppers out and my cucumbers out. All my tomatoes have germinated. Two or three peppers have and two cucumbers. None of them are big enough to go outside yet, so maybe this time next week they'll be out. There'll be two mini beanos in between, MB07 and MB08. So won't be doing the watering very much due to being away. Anyway, so what happened from this time last week to now? Okay, so I did this one last week in um, the Markham Uphill and then went to Brew Monster. I really like Brew Monster, although they need to up their fridge game a bit, to be perfectly honest. But the guy behind the bar, well, he was just giving me free samples. Um, not huge free samples, but free samples all the same. And I didn't even ask for them, um, but they were really good. They were really, really good. And to be perfectly honest, I'd be up there this afternoon if they... I don't know what they're opening now. Is, uh, I think they're the normal ones, which means at four o'clock. But, but then again, public transport, you know. <sighs> anyway, Brew Monster um, appeared in the Cardiff Craft Beer video I saw yesterday. Some guy called Sai Craft Beer Review did a tour around Cardiff. Um, pretty up to date. Didn't rain. Worth watching. He ended up in Brew Monster, but that was the one in Cardiff next to the Goat Major or the Blue Bell. I can't remember what it's called nowadays, to be perfectly honest. Um, right, okay. Yeah, more planting on Sunday. Monday, and actually Tuesday, petrol was 164.9 litre in Sainsbury's. Now, what with the bank holiday and such like, and everyone's going to fill up before the bank holiday. I decided to fill up on Tuesday night at aforementioned 164.9. Came into work the next morning, 167.9 a litre at 3p overnight. Things are hard. I'm going away tomorrow. I'm going to be driving like an old granny. Not that I already don't, to be perfectly honest. Mind you, it's going to be early, so um, there you go. Uh, it is expensive. And it's even worse for people with diesel cars, which is not particularly good. Um, and we are now in June. June, meteorological start to summer, the 21st and onwards, the nights will start to be drawn in. This happens all the time. We only just make it into summer and it's been ages and all of a sudden it gets darker again earlier. We need to have a look at the um, orbit of the Earth. Maybe we could do an ellipse instead of a circular orbit, he says, hopefully talking nonsense, as per normal. Um, and then on Tuesday, also learned that the buses... Uh, Thursday and Friday bank holiday, only a Sunday service. They're back to a Saturday service tomorrow, but then that is because it's Saturday. <sighs> yeah, not a very public service. Um, and subsidised as well, i.e. comes out your taxes. Yeah. Okay, um, what else have we got? Um, Wednesday, in work, 1st of June, Treated as a Friday, felt like a Friday, over the tumble um, and five ounce gammon steak and chips. I had a bit of an issue with the raw tomato. And this has happened before. You ask for your tomato to be raw, i.e. uncooked, they don't bring you a tomato. Spoon staff are great when you explain it to them, but sometimes in the kitchen I don't think they understand. Don't cook it. Don't cook it is not the same as leave it off the plate. It'll happen again, he says. Anyway, um, what else on Wednesday? Um, beginning of the month, 
my gas and electric readings. I'm with Octopus on a fixed one, which runs out in September, which is going to be a worry. Um, but every time you give them the readings, you get to spin a virtual wheel. Okay, uh, nothing for the gas, but a pound back on the electric. I don't want to say a Tesco's here, but every little counts. And it did, which was good. Um, yesterday, summary, really summary, more planting, etc. And cost of coffee in the morning. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to pack and I'm off early tomorrow morning. MB07, Hereford and the Hereford Beer House. Well, they seem to have a boiler failure. Not that you need it at the moment because it's nice and warm, but um, you might need a bath there if you live there. Uh, these things happen, especially on bank holidays. You can't trust them. Anyway, so that's it for now. Uh, wave, uh, drink the rest of the beer, finish packing, uh, screen wash for the car maybe. There'll be plenty of these videos coming up. You know the usual thing, me slurring and saying I've drunk too much beer. Twas ever thus.